Hey, it's Jeffrey Gurian, and the weirdest thing happened to me today. You know, I live in a nice building on the east side of Manhattan, and as I came home today, my doorman said to me, this is so crazy, he said to me, there's a large bee loose in the building. And I was like, are you kidding? And he's like, no, and it's going in and out of people's apartments. And I was like, kind of freaked out. So I came upstairs, and I think I'll just let you see for yourself. It's crazy, crazy. I have never seen a bee that size. I've seen a lot of big bees, but never like that. And it looked female to me. I picked up a magazine and I tried to swat her, but she was too big and she flew into the other room. Now I gotta go inside and look for her. This is insane. I chased her into the living room, and she's here, and I convinced her, even though she's a bee, I convinced her to talk to me on camera. Well, and her name is Binks, a bee that has a name. Binks, how are you? Hello, Jeff. Thank <laughs> you for catching me. It's amazing. I was so shocked. You're the biggest bee I've ever seen. Well, that's offensive. But the most beautiful Thank bee I've you. ever seen. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> Tell me about the whole bee thing. How did this get started? Uh, so the bee thing started when I was five almost. My in first South Africa. In South Africa. Uh, I wanted to be like David Bowie. I just wanted to have my own persona with his whole Ziggy Stardust. I was very fascinated by this, this alter ego, this entertainment value character, you know? So I was- At five years old, you were watching Bowie. Yes. See, and it's so cute, because she says Bowie, because she's from South Africa. I, people give me a hard time about that. They're always like, it's Bowie. I'm like, I, I realize it's Bowie, but I say Bowie. Because she's her own bee. Exactly. That's it. Yes. So good. So, so you were, yeah. at five years old, you were into that. I just, well, it started basically, I mean, when I really put the whole bee outfit together, I was 16. I sewed my first bee outfit on New Year's Eve. Um, but... And then I found a picture from when I was five or doing one of my shows and I was actually dressed as a bumblebee and I was like, wow, everything's full circle, you know. But Amazing. it's definitely, it's just, uh, the reason I do it is because it's my spirit animal and bees communicate through dance, which not a lot of people know about that. And which I do. I communicate through dance and music and singing. And so I'm, also, I'm known as the African bee because I'm from South Africa and I just wanted to... But not the South African bee, you're known as the African yes, bee. Yes, I'm the African bee, <laughs> the yes. That would be a bit of a tongue twister. the South African bee. <laughs> no, um, so it's just good, it's a way for me to, to hone in my identity and to keep that when I move to the big city and to differentiate myself from all the, the other successful and creme de la creme of New York, you know. I saw your video and it was great. How did you get all those taxi cabs to, to uh, cooperate with you? You're singing in the street. <laughs> In traffic, basically. Well, when you it's, dress like this, you can get quite a lot done. <laughs> yeah, that is true. That is true. No, People tend to stop for a bee. This is true. Yeah. yeah. You should try it sometime. Uh, yes, I, probably right after we finish this. But you've got the this. hair. You've I got, got the, the hair, hair, right? So I don't need the bee outfit. You don't need the bee. But this is, this is fabulous. I mean, do you Thank always you. Dr dress like this on stage? I don't always dress like this on stage. It's a special part of the show. It's when my alter ego comes through. I'm very into fashion. Mm -hmm. So I like to show different sides of my design techniques so I like to incorporate all different sorts of designs and fashions but the bee is what I'm known for. Tell me about your necklace because it's fantastic. I, Fabulous. Thank you. This is actually my favorite necklace and it just it went well with the outfit and now I get so many compliments about it. Oh I was wondering if you designed it or not. It's I didn't design it. That's one piece I didn't design I wish I designed. And Binks, I love the name Binks. It's such a fun name. Thank you. So how'd you come up with that? I didn't actually come up with that. Um, my brother nicknamed me that growing up. Really? So I just stuck with it because he's one of my biggest inspirations and he's a very determined person. So I'm just very happy with it. Tell me about your CD. What's the name of it? It is called The African Bee and we have it right here. I love it. It's my new Check EP. it out. The African Bee. <laughs> very, very sexy picture on the back. And even more sexy on the front, with a, a bee on her lips. Yes. 
Bee Stung Lips. Yes. Love it. Tell me about it. <laughs> well, um, so this EP I wanted to do for a long time. And uh, I finally got to do it. And my dad helped me with everything. We picked the tracks. We designed the colors, the fonts. And um, so there's six tracks. I'd say there's something for everybody on here. And uh, the final track, I actually sing in two different, three different languages. Because Which I'm are? What languages? So it's English, Afrikaans, and Osa. What was the last one? Kosa. Can you say that for me, <laughs> She clicks. I no, like. I can't. I can't. That's, that's good. Wow. Closer? That is good. Yeah. That is good. <laughs> See, I didn't even know how good I am. I'm just you good at know. clicking. You didn't know Amazing. what special talents you had. A lot of talents. So uh, it's very pop infused with rock influences and it's online. It's available on all the music stores, iTunes, Spotify, Amazon. Amazon? Mm -hmm. i tell you, the song I heard, Radiohead, killer. <laughs> Killer song and the way she does it and you gotta see her in traffic on a taxi cab <laughs> and, then, and the guy was actually waiting for her and then she drove away in the cab. I did, I drove Amazing. away from the video shoot. The power of a bee. <laughs> the power of a bee. Power of so bee. where can people see you? Uh, live. They can see me. I'm out usually every night performing. I always have my big shows listed on my website. Which is where? It's www.binksofficial.com. So it's spelled B I N X official because it's official. Excellent. Is it <laughs> is it is it okay to hug a bee? It's great to hug a bee. Okay, good. Especially this bee. <laughs> oh, thank you thank so you much. Thank you for having me, Jan. Coming on. Oh, so nice and to uh, you. you've seen it all here. Check out Binks and her new album, her new CD, called Binks, The African Bee. <laughs> Check it out. Thank you for having me, Jeff. You're so welcoming. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Hey guys, thanks for watching Comedy Matters TV. To check out some of our other videos, click on the boxes on either side of me. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Not just for me, but for my parents.